Uh, what do you think the factor of K1 Williams uh, being back? How do you think that's going to make a factor on Cooper Cup? I mean, it c- couldn't hurt, right? Because the Niners kind of got burned by Cooper Cup this year, both times. Now he he got he got K1 the first time too. I want to look up Cooper Cup's numbers against the Niners this year. So I'm, he had well, 11. The caller said like yeah. you, you can't really shut down Cup, but you can shut down everyone else, which is kind of interesting. Like, hold on. So he went up seven catches, 118 yards, and a touchdown week 18. And then week 10, he had 11 catches, 122 yards, and no touchdown. You see, Damn, but I think what's most important is don't give up the touchdown. He's going to get his yards and his catches. I don't think there's much you can do about it. Yeah, I think that the last game we had versus him, though, he was converting a lot of third downs. You know, uh, what he was doing was helping them score points. The first matchup, I feel like a lot of those things weren't resulting into points. It was more, right. if I remember right, it was more garbage time. And then, you know, K1 almost uh, had that buttception. You know, well, the garbage uh, time know. started in the second quarter of the first game, the way I remember it. Yeah. That, yeah, was, yeah. that so, game was over but, real quick. So, you know, don't play like that anymore. Absolutely. So, you know, sometimes stats, you know, kind of go out the window when it comes to the uh, – you know, the score and 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 what am I trying to say? The, you know, the outcome of the game. You know, I feel like, you know, when K, I feel like K1 is a lot more shifty and he's just going to play him a lot better on third downs. And the other major thing that I was thinking about was just our experience as a whole entire team of being there before. You know, uh, how much of a factor do you think that's going to play into it as far as like Matthew Stafford? This is kind of his first rodeo and whatnot. That's true. But at the same time, it's not the Rams' first rodeo. They've been in the yeah. NFC Championship before. I think the Niners and Rams are kind of similar in that sense. But maybe maybe it's Stafford who melts down and not Jimmy, which would just be the ultimate, ultimate irony. But I'm, I'm prepared for anything, man. This season yeah. keeps throwing curveballs, and it's, it's interesting. Absolutely, I I man. Anyway. All right, man. Thanks for calling in. Glad I can get you. 3420, my man. We're gonna we're gonna whoop on them. It's coming. 3420. It's All coming. Right, Two All touchdowns. Right, Yee. Two touchdowns. Yee. Have a good one. Peace. Yee yee. Love the way you keep it real. Debo killing it Sunday plus 12 touches for sure. Rams gonna get Debo'd. Debo'd. Another SoFi takeover. Levi South. Levi South is hella funny.